Here's how to sync audio for two different characters in Character Animator. First, come up with an idea and record it on your podcast. Make sure there's two people. Okay, how we get our second audio clip down here is first we're going to play through and we're going to listen to where each person stops talking and we're going to put the playhead right before the second person talks and we're going to hit command K. Oh, first you have to have your, your clip selected. Command K. That separates it. Then you go to the end of that person talking. You click on the clip. You hit Command K again. And then what that does is that cuts the clip. And you can take that one piece and bring it straight down. So here's person number one. Here's person two. And then you go through and you cut and clip everything. All right, so up next, what we do is it's time to mute track number two. So I mute track number two, and now I just have my top audio there. So I go up to multi-track, and I go down to mix down, session to new file. I do entire session, and now it puts it in a file that I can export. So then I go to file, down to export, and file. Make sure that it's MP3, and we can go ahead and rename this person one and then we're going to click okay click yes all right then we double click back here oh just to show that that exported we have person one there then we'll click double click on untitled session number one and we'll uncheck the m there and we'll check the m there which mutes the top track and unmutes the second track then the same thing multi-track mix down entire session now we have a file that we can export We'll go to file, down to export, over to file. There, this one will end up being person two. Let's go to my desktop and MP3. Okay. All right, now that is done. That one's also on my desktop. Okay, then we want to go over to character animator where I have my character. I need two characters. So I'm going to bring in my second character. So I'm going to bring in Stardust. And we know that they overlap. So if you come over here into transform, you can take the X position and you can move it over. Um, my unicorn, AKA Stardust, is talking right now because it is highlighted. If I click on Red Monster, now Red Monster talks and Stardust the unicorn does not. Okay. So what we need to do is double click up here and we need to import our audio. So we're gonna import person one and person two select both of those, import them. And then we can take both of those and bring them down. Okay, doesn't matter if you bring down one, it doesn't matter if you bring down the other. Okay, now what we have is we have two characters and two people. So what you want to do is you want to select one, hold down command and select the other and meaning one audio and one character. And not the other character. We don't want the other one. All right, there we go. So we got one and one. And we're going to go up to timeline and down to compute sync take from audio. But pay attention to which characters you selected. Because then we're going to select the other one. So then we're going to take Stardust and person number two. And we're going to do the same thing. Timeline, compute, lip sync, take from audio. And then it's going to work its magic. It'll add these visims down here. And then when we hit play. Hello, class, and welcome to this edition of how to record two different characters <clears throat> on Roadcaster using Character Animate. Uh, as you know, I am gone today. Yeah, yeah, he's gone. All right, perfect. There it is. Um, enjoy.